a Magi from Siwa. I thought Magi is was supposed to protect the Pharaoh. I am Magi to no Pharaoh. You see this? I can read my own name, Nat! We will find you. We will find you in your sleep! Sleep. I never sleep. I just wait in the shadows and I will kill you all! Everyone who sniffed the air that day in Siwa! You have made new friends. They were setting up an ambush. It's a good thing I came to welcome you, huh? <laughs> it's been months. Look at that beard, huh? It's been nearly a year, my friend. It feels good to get out and fight. I am out of practice. In Siwa, everyone differs to the soldiers on pain of death. Or worse. I've killed one of the masked ones. The Heron. Four more. Mm. Come. It has been a long road. You need rest? Ah, no. No rest. Not until all the masked ones' guts lie baking in the sand. God, I have missed you. Rest, my friend. It has been a difficult day. I have no interest in rest. I must prepare for this man. Rabia! Eh, my Rabia! I have worried about you. Ah, uh, you know me, eh? <laughs> you should be worried. Ah. Look at you. Cuts? Contusions? I'm, I'm fine. Hey, sit! Hmm? Sit! Sit! I'll take care of it. Ah, uh, you haven't changed. You and I, uh, I've always patched you two up. Made excuses to your parents. <laughs> Times have changed, but you, I can count on. Slumbering Osiris. <laughs> I thought you would never wake up. Ah, Rabia patched me up and I just... I let you sleep. You need to be alert to tangle with Medunumun. In fact, my friend... A new bow? See if you like it. Good. Hatsiba! What is it? Soldiers are coming for you! Go! Come, quickly! Sultan, no one gets out of the house alive. Hepsiva! We're just here to talk! No Mark Rujek's been killed! Your friend, the Magi, may have been involved! Come out! If you wish to clear his name! All the problems of Siwa are here. I tried to help everyone, but it is more than I can do. So you are telling me you do not have the powers of a god? <laughs> but the real problem is that man you want to kill. Majunumon. The people were hopeful when he first arrived. Surely things would improve. <gasps> we soon learn the truth, actually. I 
fear for the safety of your family, priest. I will move them to a more secure area. That is the man you're up against. I will find him and kill him. A Junoman is a lot more powerful than he looks. And he is surrounded by the finest soldiers. I do not care. You'll be killed. You need to get tougher if you want to murder that spindly shit. For sure, you need better armor. Uh, I can make that myself. Weapons are more difficult. The soldiers took everything in the village. I will talk to the blacksmith. Yes, Benny Pei can certainly make something for you. Or Senu can help you find what you need. Senu? Senu is alive. Look who is coming. Senu, old girl. In fine form. Rabia has nursed her to health. I must thank her. The people are desperate for your help, Bayek. They'll help you if you help them. I understand. Don't think so long. Jump. Yes, Papa. Hey, trust me, you can. I do. I will. Uh, jump then. Come back. You're not ready. I can do it, Papa. I can. Ah! Oh, shut up, you filthy little shit. Help! Help me! That's Shanjira. I said shut up. Run home to your mother. Chenzera will be fine. I will take care of it. Magi Bayek! Go, now. I'm scared. I don't want to go home alone. Oh, Emu, just do what I say, please. Go! Magi Bayek! I'm indeed Magi here. Who summons me? Seize your weapon and follow me. See that no one comes in. Okay, oh, are you hot? Go ahead. Try it your way. I'll leave my son out of there! Your son has something to explain to you. Would the Ibis show him the orb? 
We believe we need this to enter the vault. This is a waste of time! The boy is frightened. It's all right. Papo, they need you to tell them about the vault. They need to know how to use this. As measure, you must have some clue to your legend that explains its use. I don't know anything about this vault! Please leave my son out of my this! Lord. The Pharaoh has been aroused. He insists. He will be discovered. Here. Quickly! Talk to your son. If the vault isn't open when we return, you'll never see him again. Papa! I did what you said, but... Ah, it's all right, son. No? Papa, I can get it to you. What? No! Come on, don't! They're going to hurt us. Come on, Come on. This foolish waste of time! Come on, come on! No good time! Tell us! So, I, I, I don't know. We must go now. I will cut the heart from the boy. No, no, wait, 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 wait! He Stop. will never know the afterlife! Uh. No, 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 I, I will tell you! I will tell you! Stop. I will tell you! No, 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 no! for time! Watch this! The snake takes that as your answer. Oh, no! No! We thought you were dead. You could not even save your own son. You are no one. By yak of nothing. Father to nobody! And here is your nobody! May the hidden one greet you. The Lord of the Duat awaits. Well done, my friend. Our hero returns. You brought joy to Siva. I should get to Alexandria. I need to see Aya. Don't be in too much of a hurry. Siwa will always need its magi. But you are the protector here now. I'm always pleased to help. Come see me when you are certain you are ready to go. We will drink beers to our friendship, huh? <laughs> I must leave Siwa. There are others to whom I must deliver justice. Especially the one known as the Snake. How will you find these men? Aya has been tracking them in Alexandria. I must find her. She said she would be visiting her cousin at the Great Library. Great Library? And she said if you are coming to tell you one word. Serapis. Serapis? The god that Greeks and Egyptians share. Of course, I see. And bike, do something about that beard. <laughs> Goodbye, my friend. Oh shit! Layla, you need a refill on cyclosporin. Stat. Layla, wakey wakey! Mm. Uh. 
Don't make me come down there. Layla? Layla? <gasps> come on back. Layla, are you with me? Habibti. I told you not to call me that. The thing is, the fastest way to get your attention is to piss you off. I'm paying attention. Okay, you need to take a break. The Animus is rejecting you. <sighs> I'm fine. Yes, but your kidneys aren't. Go add more cyclosporin before they shut down. Yes, Nurse Geary. That's Medical Officer Geary to you. So? How did it go? My mods are holding. Subject's memories are perfectly clear. If this doesn't convince Abstergo to give me a place on the Animus Project, nothing will. I am amazing! Who do you have in there? His name is Bayek of Siwa. The death of his son turned him into a killer. Think you'd be of interest, Abstergo? Don't start. You know, they're not gonna be happy with how he handled this assignment. They know I don't work by the book. Well, this time you lit the book on fire and then stomped on it. Anyway, none of this will matter if you're comatose. Now go get that cyclosporin. <sighs> Got the cyclosporin. Two CC should do it. Don't forget the alcohol wipe. Therapist. Now what? Ah, where is Aya? Ah, Serapis. I wrote a tragic comic pastoral epic centered on him. Ah. You're by, I guess. Aya is eager to see you. She said. Quickly, follow me. <laughs> I missed you. <laughs> <laughs> Never again should we spend months apart. We only have each other. Without him, what? Let us be together. Us two. Each to each. <laughs> I have news. You are scarred by justice. Uh, I bludgeoned Bedunamun with this. I hate that we have to do these things. But I am grateful that you did. If I am honest, I took pleasure in it. I've missed your touch. I have missed touching you. <laughs> I killed as well. Acteon. I hunted him down and discovered a mask in his room. When he returned, I forced him to wear it. Then I thrust this knife through his eye slits. Aya. But I was careless. Another of the masked ones tracked me to my home. It was even more difficult. We have one more. Then, we will be done. <laughs> Look at this. I took it from Acteon. Apollodorus tells me it is a papyrus from the Royal Council. Which means the snake 
is in Ptolemy's court. How does this Apollodorus know these things? He has informants everywhere, because of his work with Cleopatra. But Cleopatra? She's been declared a criminal. <laughs> By her treacherous brother, yes. She plans to take back the throne. She wants this snake dead as much as we do. And she trusts me. She gave me this to slit his throat. It's an ancient blade that killed the tyrant Xerxes. A weapon of justice. <laughs> Ingenious. Ah. I will go to the palace and discover who uses the seal of the snake. And I will use this. Why have you dragged me into the land of the dead? You sought to kill my wife! Your whore of a wife is a murderess. Wafely and wanton. I did my duty as a Philagetai. And for this, you have taken my life. Is your vengeance above all law, Medjai? Be warned. The Philakes will hunt you down and exact revenge. May the Hidden One walk beside you. The Lord of the Duat awaits. Official papers. This just belongs to the royal scribe himself, Eudorus. False bottom. A letter. Esteemed Ibis, the Pharaoh remains compliant and is our puppet in all things. Act with caution in Siwa. The murder of the heron was but the first. Two from among us here in Alexandria have also been killed. However, the situation is under control. Canadios is actively questioning the populace. We commend your efforts, Ibis. Long life. Stamp to the seal of the snake. The snake is Eudorus, the royal scribe. murdered my son before my eyes. You are a fool. At the temple, in Siwa! That forsaken shithole? I had nothing to do with that disaster. It is too late for your lies. Anubis awaits. It is worth the loss to slay the snake at last. Snake. This snake will never die. Go. Son of Apep, the Lord of the Duat awaits.
My dearest. The snake, Gennadios, are dead. Uh, it was Eudorus. He died flailing in the baths. I wish I had been there. I should pull you out. Your adrenaline and BP are elevated, and it's affecting your heart rate and hormonal markings. Serotonin and oxytocin in particular. What happened in there? Aya's here. Who's Aya? My ex-wife. I could feel her nearby. You can feel her? Pretty sure that's the bleeding effect. Along with Bayek's memories, you're, you're also experiencing his emotions. No, you dork. I think she's actually in this cave. Spouses usually share the same tomb. A second mummy? We should really report to Abstergo. Maybe after I find Aya. I I'm gonna call it in if you don't. Deanna, no! If you do it there, well, get no credit. They'll cut me out like always. <sighs> okay. I was right, she's here! Oh, there you are, thank God! I can almost taste the blood. Uh, uh, okay, you're making less and less sense, Leila. We need to report. Not yet. Not yet? So when? <sighs> Adding Aya's DNA to the chamber. It'll take time to sequence. You won't be able to sync with her memories right away. What is it? The snake. What if he was not the last? Of course he was the last. They are all dead. Justice is done. <sighs> if there's any question, Apollodorus will know. He knows all. And where will I find this man who knows so much? He is with Cleopatra. But find his man first near the Hippodrome. Hey! <laughs> I'll tell Thanos that Gennadios is dead and meet you later. Polodoros. You there! Are you here to kill me or to be my friend? Friend. Bike of Siwa. Ah, then your help, please. You are I as Magi, huh? Any other survivors? Only Damastis. They took him prisoner. And the scroll? What of the scroll? Damastis had it. That ass Damastis should have destroyed it. Cleopatra owes you much. Can you get to a healer by yourself? I've killed you, Doros. Huh? Well done. He was the snake, yes? Man to man, Baek, there is much you have yet to understand. <laughs> man to man, I need an answer. Now I must take the measure of you first. Rescue Domastis and recover the scroll. And then I will know if you're the man that Aya claims you to be. The sensation is most delightful. This way. Oh, don't worry. She doesn't hold the grudge. <laughs> Where is my opium pipe?
I will sleep with anyone as long as they agree to be executed in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> like Xanthivis. He was well satisfied with his bargain. Who is this toothsome fellow? In Mehoto Ek Nebsheven. My queen, this is, uh... Well? It is a generous offer. But I've already pledged my life to this woman. Aya, you have chosen well. Come, we have much to discuss. Celebrate, my friends! <laughs> you were meant to kneel. <laughs> ah, Pasheremta. Meet Aya and Bayek. They put an early end to Eudoros. Delightful. You are joining our efforts, then? We do not know what your efforts are. Eudorus was a member of the Order of Ancients. They are responsible for my exile. They tore me from my throne. And why should I care about them? Well, the snake has many heads. Those heads make up the Order. The snake is the man who killed my son. It is not so simple. What are they talking about? I don't know. They must know something. The Order of Ancients seeks to control all Egypt. Ptolemy is but their puppet. We have informants in each region, but they have been unable to touch the Order. Across Egypt, mysterious forces work against us. For instance, here, in the Nile Delta, the endless sands swallow up whole villages, yet a malignant human force moves with them. That force is one of the Order of Ancients, called the Scarab. And over here, in most sacred Giza? A shadowy figure called the Hyena controls all that occurs. What is certain is that Giza is the land of death and loss. And then there's Memphis. All is cast in my land. Even the sacred Apis bull himself. The one called the lizard has worked a sort of diabolical power. So the snake is the order of ancients? Yes. Eudorus was known as the Hippo. You are right, my love. He was not the last one. All of these are. When the Order wants something, as in Siwa, it does not hesitate to crush all in its path. For Siwa, now Fayum. It is the most oppressed region in all of Egypt. Where the crocodile wields cruel power, the denizens live in constant fear. That is the fate that awaits all Egypt if we fail to stop the order. We need decisive action. It is time for assassinations. We still have not found the man who killed Remu. Our sunshed will weep with joy when we clear the map of those figures. You are my Magi now. Protector of the true Pharaoh of Egypt. So it shall be. Tonight, we drink. Celebrate. Make love. Tomorrow. There are many terrible stories about the scarab. I am sure Apollodorus told you. Tales of mutilation, disappearances, and folk buried in the desert and left to die. A horrendous fate, trapped in the shimmering sand, your mind and body pounded by the remorseless sun. 
waiting for the final release into the Duat. The last man who asked questions about the Scarab was near beaten to death, with his tongue cut out. <clears throat> who was he? Paul Cooper, father-in-law to the most powerful man in the region, Tahaka. That boy, Awab, is his grandson. Hey, you tired of winning? I'm looking for your grandfather. Do you know where he went? No, he left on the road to Camp Piros. He should have been home by now. I'll see if I can find him along the road. Grandfather! Are you all right? Is he hurt? Banged up, bruised, and thirsty. The soldiers did not take kindly to him, but he will be all right. Where's your father, Kawa? You must speak of this. Father is away, on his great work. Mother! Grandfather is hurt! Soldiers mistook him for a beggar again. Father! What have you done this time? He was searching for the scarab. I hope he can help me. And in return, I can protect your family. The scarab is nonsense. Everyone knows this. He wants you to read them. Uh, it looks like this scarab is summoning warriors to the city of Letopolis. By the gods! That is where my husband is. But the city swallowed by the desert. It is father's destiny to rebuild it. We're going to join him soon. Right, mother? Yes. My husband Tahaka has been slaving there for months. I'm sure he can help you. He knows everyone there. If you go, tell him I can't wait to see him. <laughs> yeah, of course I will, Kawab. Your son is very proud of your work. He misses you. You'll be here soon. I dream of my son and his sons following in my steps. The world is made by great men dreaming big. What do you dream of, Bayek? I do not have the luxury of dreams. Just finding the scarab. The scarab preys upon the weak. There's no threat to me. Are you not afraid of the Scarab attack? Seems after what he did to your father-in-law. What happens to poor Gupa tears me. Whatever my life's work, whatsoever I did to bring that down upon him, I beg the gods forgive. Master Tahaka! They're attacking the ruins again. Bayek, come fight with me. Glad you made it safely, Maharet. <laughs> yes, the gods blessed our passage. We saw vultures and a hyena and so much sand. <laughs> Enough sand to fill a lifetime. That is why we need so many to help us with our great work. And what do you promise them, Tahaka? A parcel of land with a house to call their own. They must only help reclaim it from the desert. That is all? Just dig up your house. It is no simple task. We must all pitch in to honor the gods. People know his vision is a true one. It is good to honor your father, Kawa. The savior of Lotopolis. Hmm. Let us have some honey dates now. And are you all right, Bayer?
must be against you, Tahaka. Far as you do. Eno, good boy. Smile upon you. So, this is how a dream dies. I could have built something to last an age. And Gupa could have sung stories of your accomplishments. There are things I regret! We all labor for higher powers! We are all enthralled to greater forces! There is no escape! I am but one in the Order of Ancients! This victory will bring you no peace! It is not peace that I seek. It is not for my soul that I walk this path. The Order of Ancients will remember me as the bringer of waters and a builder of cities! Oh, the desert will blow in and scatter the dream of Metropolis like dust. Take care of him. Try to make him understand if you can. You have brought blood and death to my house. You are blind. But now you must open your eyes. Your husband was Iskarab. He did this. Your father was tortured and scarred by this man. As were so many others. No. It is up to you to raise your boy into the light out of the blood and shadows of his father's legacy. I'm sorry, my son. Just like the Battle of Salamis, Captain. I have you trapped. <laughs> Here comes Themistocles. And that is the game. Oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hamodo! Foxy, that's why are we delivering all this treasure? We could retire to Lesbos with this amount of gold. <laughs> What say you, desert rat? If that chest doesn't make it to Pompeii, this ship won't either. We crawl through Hades to deliver it if we have to. Not enough. Back to work, you slack black horse! Temestis! My trusted shield boy, get to it, huh? We've been hired to bribe Pompeii, to save a queen, and to win a kingdom! <laughs> The usual fare for us mercenaries, huh?
Civil war in Egypt and a mercenary trireme comes to my aid. In the midst of war with Caesar, I find it odd. Who in Hades are you? Well, we could have let you die. Pompeius Magnus. Greetings and friendship from Queen Cleopatra. Cleopatra offers gold to win my favor once I've won Rome. Is that what friendship means to your queen? Whose face graces that coin? Do Roman women receive the same honor? An alliance with Cleopatra is a union of true power. She wants more than an ally. She seeks a king. A valuable friendship indeed. Agreed. My fleet will soon be ready for Egypt. Welcome to Meret's wares, traveler. Well, what do you think? Junk. Be off, then. Ah, uh, I haven't finished. Are you blind? I've nothing left to show you. But you've much to tell me. About the hyena. Ah, uh, funny. As it turns out, that happens to be the most expensive thing I'm offering. <laughs> funny indeed. Delivery upon payment. Now what can you tell me? The hyena is not her real name. <laughs> easy, easy. A poor attempt at humor, I'm afraid. Where can I find her? Her name is Khaliset. A favor. Some customers of mine took my horse after a dispute. Their camp lies in a quarry just south of here. Take my man, retrieve my horse, and I'll give you what you came for. Ah, how you find yourself in Apollodorus' company escapes me. Then you'll deliver as promised. My word is my word. But I have one more thing to ask of you. Ah, done with your games. All right. The hyena lives in a cavern just over those hills. Day and night, she roams the desert collecting silica, precious teardrops of the gods. What has happened to those who have interfered is best left unsaid. If I find you've led me on another futile chase, it won't be my words that hit your ears. A thousand promises. I have no reason to defy you. Alicet was doing a ritual. She began by calling to Osiris with these offerings. She used a knife to sacrifice her captives. She collected their blood for some dark purpose. She was attempting to learn these strange symbols. She must have found them in this room. When she knew the symbols, she carved them here and ended the ritual with one final prayer over the sarcophagus. Alicet must be trying to bring someone back to life. But just who is buried down here? The child. My child! You lost your child. I haven't. Her rest is temporary. You have intervened on her reawakening. And yet you aligned yourself to the Order. Ravaged this tomb. Halicet! Don't you dare say my name! My name does not merit your lips, you who have dishonored her. I am a good mother. Now I will show you what happens to those who desecrate my daughter's tomb. Now! Do I walk among the dead now? A just end. You defiled the dead and enabled the people who killed my son. All on a selfish whim. No. I gathered the silica for them. 
It powered the magic stone of those who came before. You saw it, didn't you? These symbols only needed to be learned. It is not meant for us. It makes no difference now. I wanted to protect my daughter in life and death. I have done neither. Osiris! Please grant me reunion! She walks alone in the field of reeds. Memphis, it is beautiful, but Perhaps it stinks of the battlefield, some part of the ritual. or a tomb. I will vomit if I hear more. Have no doubt of this. If our child dies, I die. No, my lotus, do not speak like that. I must go to the seer's house. Please leave me be. Priest. Uh, uh, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, uh... I have come to seek the lizard. Oh, the lizard. One more affliction for Memphis. The city withers in the darkness of a curse. Disease, pestilence, the poison stink of the air. The ape is cool sick and nearly unto death. Gods have abandoned us. The people look to me for guidance, but I am as lost as they. Hush! <laughs> That is even my own house. My wife, Time Hotep, has miscarried three times this year. She is with child again, but if, if she loses a fourth. <laughs> I will look into this curse. My wife's seer can help. His house is to the southwest. If the gods are responsible. I will kneel beside you as they strike us down. Grow, O oh light! Come forth, O oh light! Ah. My child! Oh. You have come at last. Who is this man? He is the Deliverer. Many years I have waited for him. What? Quick! Help me dream my child away from death! Let us proceed with the ritual. Sothis, reveal yourself here today and answer me without falsehood. Let your eyes be opened. Devoid of moisture, come forth from the stream. Sothis, let their eyes be opened. Let your eyes be opened.
obscène ou votre créa. I have traveled through the tomb, dark and lonely ground. They are returned, safe from him, who would close their eyes in darkness. My child lives. Praise to the gods. What do you see? Your enemy and hers are the same. Refuse. The temple food, he who prepares it, poisons your womb with flesh of the dead. Go and slay the poisoner.
and lift Memphis out of evil. Praise to him who will deliver us all. Aya! My love. Are you well? Uh, better for seeing your face. There is a strangeness in your eyes. What afflicts you? Dreams. Of our son. Bayek. The high priest's wife has been poisoned. Her seer claims that her poisoner is our enemy. The lizard? I believe so. The apis bull is also at the point of death. Let's go to the temple. We can speak more of your dreams on the way. This is a subtle way of poisoning an animal. My sisters, this is surely an accident. No one, maybe. But not a bush of... We had to save Pantratis! Hey! Who? Our brother! Bandits! ripped him away from us as we walked in the market. They forced us to poison the god. They told us they were going to feed our brother to crocodiles in the suite. We have not slept through the night since. I'm so sorry. We had no choice. We never... Something's wrong. These are no curses. The order is surely behind this. Are you hurt? Did they mistreat you? They kept me tied up, fed me little but crusts of bread fit for beggars. So? This is the lizard's work. And so I must stain my hands with another priest's blood. The order is everywhere. To protect Egypt, I would kill a thousand priests. You and I are pledged to violence, now and always. As they rule, the gods curse our land, withholding the river's floods. But as the living goddess ascends the throne, the waters will rise again. Through me, Memphis shines as rubies set in gold. Through me, Egypt triumphs. I cannot lose them. They must know my voice is that of the goddess. My queen. The Apis bull persists in ailing. We have found the cause of his sickness. He was poisoned. Who did this? The twin priestesses. Have them boiled to death inside a bronze bull. Goddess, no. They were coerced. The brother was kidnapped by a priest of Anubis with a blue scarf and a cough. A tepi? But he is amongst my closest advisors. Those living in one's shadow are the least worthy of trust. If even a tepi is against me. Your wife and child were threatened by him. But now they are safe. We can overcome this. The priests of Anubis will be conducting rites in the great temple. Look for their masks. My blade will serve as well as his. Uh, no, I... Uh, that's me. I care not who kills the priest. Let it be done before we head to Heraklion in the north. 
Wait. Tanun, the father, breathes strength into your arm. Memphis. I serve the ways of old Egypt. <coughs> old Egypt asks a heavy price. Innocents, mutilated. Children ripped from the womb. The high priest's name abused. His name was Muck before you arrived. The masses are the cattle of the gods. Driven by the herdsman's whip. You are one of them, by you are a cow! It is will that drives me. Not fear. Oh yes? And who passes the whip over your back? Who demands that you stay in your car with my death? I have my gods. Now face yours. My queen, they acted only to lift the threat on their brother's life. Curses will trouble you no more. Hetep. What could have driven him to such madness? Memphis is yours again. Ours. Dark matter settled, we can finally prepare for the festival of Apis. May demons feast on Hetepi's car. And may those guilty of Chemo's death soon follow. It is agony to leave you, but I must go on alone. Aya! I will stand by my duty. Where will your duty take you? North, to set the sea aflame. <laughs> I walk on your water. I hope we will hunt together again soon. Until then, let us take this night as ours. So, now they send the son of Egypt against me. It has been a long time since I spilled so much blood. I was sent by Apollodorus. We share a common interest. Who are you? And what do you want, eh? I'm Bayek Siwa. And I seek information on the crocodile. The phantom that has brought Fayum to its knees. What could you want with him? 
He belongs to a group that is destroying Egypt. I intend to hunt every last one of them down. Bayek of Siwa. You don't know what you are up against. The crocodile has transformed not only the land, but the people. Those who do not cower in fear are made to work for him. And you have no idea who the crocodile is? I stole a ledger from a Greek magistrate I suspect of corruption. It should reveal the identity of this crocodile. And if we get it to Apollodorus, we may be able to bring down the whole organization. Where's the ledger now? I gave it to my wife Henut to hide. As long as the Ptolemies think it's with me, my family is safe. That is why I have to stay on the move. Here. This will tell Henut you are a friend to be trusted. It is for my daughter, Shadia. Once you have the ledger, find me at the docks south of Uhemeria. Oh, I love my new doll, Bayek. I will name her Iset, and she will be the protector of all Fayum. Ever since Hotefles got a hold of that ledger, Fayum has been on edge. Soldiers with torches patrol every night, and this aunt's kitchen was practically razed to the ground. They have left Shadia and me alone at least. Hotefles has made sure of that. Where is the ledger now? I instructed our most loyal servant to hide it in our villa. They can search the place as many times as they want. They will never find it. Can you take me there? I have been summoned to the lighthouse for another of their routine investigations. Ah, that may not be safe. The Ptolemaic authorities seem to be working with the crocodile. It happens every few days. Don't worry. They wouldn't dare touch someone in an official position. Shadia, show Bayek the way to our home. Shadia. Shadia. <laughs> It is over. The crocodile has won. The ledger lost. My daughter. My Shadia. He has taken everything from us. He will pay for this. And all those who serve him. None of that will bring Shadia back. No. But at least you'll have the comfort of revenge. We both will. I hope so. I will do anything I can to help you, brother. Has he not been able to tell you anything? Only that there were other men with the soldiers. Large, imposing warriors. One red-haired. Bandits? Soldiers? I believe they were gladiators, from the arena in Crocodilopolis. It seems this... this monster uses fighters to do his bidding. I will find this monster, friend. He will die.
That looks like. My friend, my brother. Oh, oh, shit! It's good to see you. What are you doing in Fayou? I heard this was a good place to to prosper, hmm? <laughs> but I never expected to find you here, Kensa. <laughs> what can I say? I heard the call of the arena. <laughs> Can you believe it? I am a gladiator now. Eh? <laughs> but come, come. Let us talk. And drink. <laughs> I'm telling you, Bayek, I am so close to my dream. If only I was given the chance, I know I could become champion. I mean wealth, luxury, fame. What more could a woman want? Huh? That's why I came to Fayum, to make a new life for myself and bury the past. But I was turned away from the arena doors. <laughs> so you have finally given up trying to put the world to rights. Good. Such things are impossible. Felix is slow to trust outsiders. But do not worry. With my backing, we'll soon be fighting side by side. First, we drink. And in the morning, we can go to the arena for the proper introductions. Eh, it's good to have you here, old friend. I want this man to be my partner. As it happens, the Iberian was torn apart by lions yesterday. I may have an opening. And if Kensa vouches for you... You will need a title if you're going to team up, though. How about the Siwa Warriors? I think the Guardians of Siwa would be more fitting. Is that memorable enough for you? I have heard worse. Come inside. These are the scraps that Felix wants to throw our way. <laughs> they make a poor meal, my brother. <laughs> I'm going to slice off your balls and feed them to you. Our main obstacle to glory, the Gallic brothers. I know who they are. Victory for the Guardians of Siwa! The new darlings of the arena! Who knows how far they can go? of Siwa are victorious once again! Toot the Gallic Brothers be next! Sorry I left you to fight alone, but I hear you did me proud. Felix sent you out on a job. Who was it for? I'll tell you everything in good time, brother. Just know that our future has never looked brighter. Here are the contenders.
Highlander to the crown. The Guardians of Siwa. Undefeated. Unmatched. It's the Garlic Brothers. <laughs> The Gallic brothers are defeated! You killed the child called Shadia! That is the least you deserve! The light up. We didn't kill her like one! We have done many terrible things, Siwan! But the murder of the child is not one of them! All hail the new champions! We were there! The guardians of Siwa! Capture the girl! And take her to Berenike! To, to the crocodile! It was she who drowned the child, took a book from her, ordered a stone tied to her ankles, and pushed her in the water. There was nothing we could do. This is the real reason you came to me, isn't it? To uncover this patron, this crocodile. Bayek, why didn't you confide in me? Huh? I would have helped you. You're a mercenary, just now, like them. I couldn't take the chance. What fate awaits the fallen? No. Will it be life? Bayek. Or death. You know me better than... Death. Bayek, you have to know! Shadia! Murdered by one of you. Shadia. Who? Shadia! She was the child you drowned! Like all of your kind, you fail to see what greatness lies in store for Egypt. Is that what you tell yourself? You do not remember those you killed. She was the child of Henot and Hotefris. Henot was a stubborn rock. That ledger would have meant the end to all our hopes. You destroyed families. <laughs> I did what had to be done. I will destroy everything you stand for, Berenike! And I will destroy all others like you! But for now, all that matters is that you killed Shadia! And the last word you will remember is her name! Shadia! Perfect that you have met us in Heraklion, city of wine, women, whatever a magi like you desires and deserves. Ah, to the queen. Bayek, you arrive at an opportune time. Cleopatra. I'm still looking for the men who killed my son. The order is neutralized. Was my hunt for me or for you? I have two more names. The order can't be... And how many more names after that? As many as it takes. I wish to bring my son to the afterlife where he belongs, not... Ah, I like you, Cleopatra. 
But the royal matters that seduced my wife do not sway me so. What does the badge mean to you? Have you forgotten? This badge means more to you than it does to me. This is not one man we are fighting. Nothing ends simply. Aya has understood that you have a new reality. I am your pharaoh. You are Magi to all of Egypt. Follow me. We have a gift. Votu! Just kill me already, you coward! Here is your gift. He is in the order of ancients, like Septimius. We found him snooping around the villa. We think he knows who killed your son. My brother Septimius killed your son, and I don't give a shit! Shit-giving is my job. I just fucked those twins up! Venator! <laughs> Enough for you. I will press him for more information. I suggest uh, you visit the brothel in town. Yes. Go dig through this Dionysian town and unearth the plot against us. I have... Bayek! Aha, you smell of the sea. The high seas have taken me for some time, but now I'm yours. Move! Hey, old man. Oh, are you injured? Just a flesh wound. <laughs> I... I am fine. Nothing hurts anymore. My mind is a riot. All I have is that I am pushed further. One more attempt to snuff me out. My queen, rest and remember I do that... not need rest. This civil war is no closer to ending. I need a fucking throne. My throne rots in the hands of my brother. Instruct Foxidus to prepare ship. We head to meet Pompey. My last resort. You two go ahead and tell him we're coming. Yes, my queen. Bayek, if we don't get to Pompey first, Septimius might. Ah, Septimius has beat us. Funny how all great men are reduced to food for maggots. This is a cemetery for our ambitions. No, no, it can't be. Where is Caesar? He has arrived in Alexandria. He is heavily guarded, so there's... Bring me to him. I will get to Caesar if I have to drag myself through the sewers of the palace. that our cargo is a goddess. I apologize. We have no kings or queens on our ship. Only gods and goddesses. So you should fit right in. All strange and terrible things are welcome. <laughs> I am worried that my quarters are not as comfortable as your palace. Comforts? We despise them. My loyal shield boy! Are you fit? I am in awe of this goddess. We must do her well. I can't believe she's on our ship. Hey, don't be fooled by appearances. She needs us more than we need her. <laughs> Aya. Ah, she is the real goddess. There, in the distance. Aya, already showing Bayek the best places to make love, huh? Enough, Fox. It 
is time to make war. <laughs> Let's not celebrate too roundly, old man. We're afloat in the sea with a cargo with a thousand ships. I wonder if Cleopatra survived unmarked. Those clothes looked expensive. All are safe. We are done. <laughs> Attacking Star Wars! Oh, we are not done. Ptolemy is Malakir, not dead yet. Get out of the ring boats. Use the fog to hide your escape. But I will take care of this. Destiny is a fucker sometimes, Aya. Enjoy the calm water. I will stay in the storm. Free, you fool! Don't mind the flaming arrows, huh? <laughs> For battle, we will honor our goddies! We cannot afford to spill any Roman blood. We cannot traipse into the palace armed to the teeth. So we disarm then. Armed or not, they will recognize her. For once, perhaps, a queen's entrance is unnecessary. Pompey was your enemy, Caesar. He was my friend first. But you are right, Ptolemy. Now let us discuss our alliance. <clears throat> what is this? Forgive, Lord Caesar. We bring a gift from our pharaoh, Cleopatra. Pharaoh? This is no gift. These are my sister's friends. It is a trap. In place of an envoy, Cleopatra sends a rug? I wonder how you all entered my palace. God! Kill these traitors! My wretched brother. He's at the wine go to vinegar. And my kingdom to pieces. Great lady. Your audacity is equaled only by your beauty. Flavius, please. I can offer you what my brother failed at with me. Marriage. A true marriage, that is. If you ally with my sister, I will kill every last Roman in Alexandria. Enough of the big words, little brother. Out, all. You will each be sent for when our Congress is concluded. I wish to hear both Ptolemy's side of the story. Bothinus and Septimius gone. We miss them. You will have your vengeance soon. This is Cleopatra's time to officially become queen. If she is crowned queen, we will be able to act from within. Crush the network. Tomorrow, our queen will have turned flattery into progress. We'll reconvene tomorrow at the gardens. You proved your worth tenfold today. You truly are great magis. This is a tighter squeeze than the cave west of Siwa. We were smaller in those days. <laughs> Rex Immortalis. Stuff he is holding. The markings. Ever since I was a boy, I've idolized this man. He is similar to you. I wept at the base of his statue in Rome. At 30, he was a god with an empire stretching across the known world. 
What have I done with my five long decades here on Earth? It me, did you faint? Together we can do more than Alexander did. Yes. How long before the Queen stops impressing Caesar and starts impressing us? Our needs are hers as well. She will deliver. My Caesar, our emissaries have been captured at the southern garrison of Alexandria. Soldiers have reported a hostile environment. Captured? Is this Ptolemy's diplomacy? I will send my guard. Greek soldiers will pass more freely through the city than Romans. Let us settle this matter, my queen. Flavius, come. Look. We have found the great king. We need to alert Caesar. What happened to you? Septimius, they are preparing a siege of the harbor. They want to take the palace. I will not betray Caesar! How many more heads must I chop off before Caesar understands? This is futile. A change of plans. The lion says we must march on the Pharos and trap the queen. Then they said they left for. Where? Where? You have loyal men, Caesar. Septumius plans on trapping you in the palace. You have no time. As I foresaw, war. Levius, they want fire. Let us burn the whole damn harbor. And if we change the Pharos light, the rest of the fleet will know what to do. We will join them by chariot. Salve, Lord Caesar. I will make the order. My queen, you should accompany me into battle. As these soldiers rip each other apart, I shall stay on my throne. I am queen until a sword plunges through my heart. And even then, my blood will stay on my throne. Good then. I stay. My life is yours to do with as you will. Now, the most crucial part of the plan. Put this into the brazier of the Pharos. She will accompany me through the city. Now, let havoc reign. Aya, if you find my brother, Ginestoi, <laughs> we will put our queen on the throne. You are the only queen worthy of the throne. <laughs> <sighs> Give me the powder. Caesar thinks a woman cannot do this job. <laughs> Prove Caesar wrong, my love. Ptolemy's men are breaking through our line. No. Wait until I see the signal. I can't believe you trusted a woman to do something of such importance. How are the fleet to receive their orders? Patience, Caesar. The die is cast. <laughs> Come. We go to the battlefield. Medjai, cover the retreat. Many men have died to die. All have found themselves dead by her blade. Hi! 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 Ah! 
weak. Uh, I have nothing left to throw. Any time, Bayek. There will be songs of us, Bayek. Now, we must join the ships. We will be heroes. Sword and mind. Hysteria. According to our speculators, Potinus leads the charge. Keep the soldiers distracted, Caesar. I will handle Potinus and Victorium! Your role in that insane order comes to an end, Potinus. Face your judgment. They went too far in Siba. I knew it then. But I just wanted peace for Egypt. Your peace leaves many wanting. This is inevitable. A good rule always does. My apologies, Bayek of Siwa. My fee is covered, it seems. Now may I go to my glory. There is no glory left in Egypt. Deal with him under our laws. He killed my son! defeated our enemies. Only I can lead Egypt into a new era of prosperity. Done with Septimius Mount. We are banned from the palace. I do not begrudge the venom in your eyes, but listen for a moment. Speak quickly, or you will find yourself at the wrong end of my blade. Your services are no longer needed. Cleopatra has granted you gold. I am sorry, Aya. Sorry? We gave her everything. 
We gave her that damn clown, and she stands next to him! And where is justice for us? Septimius was supposed to be judged by Rome. Is Caesar protecting the order? There are compromises to make a queen of Cleopatra. The man who killed our son is your ally. We are going to do whatever it takes to kill him. You realize? Look, Caesar blames you for the death of Ptolemy. A pharaoh, a god, by I, I cannot change this. Be damned what Caesar thinks. It is with Cleopatra that I made the pact. Give me time, Aya. I will ease this for us. Until then, I beg you, be careful. Not everything is as it seems. Ah! Traitor! With all my words, I have nothing to say now. Cleopatra has been poisoned by Rome, and we by her treachery. We will burn with Egypt. The order is stronger now. They have Rome. I will deal with this. Hold on, hold on. I was wrong. I am responsible. When my boy died, I fought back with rage and anger. But this only made them stronger. We are all different, but we fought together to put Cleopatra on the throne. Now this was a mistake, my friends, but at least it brought us together. Now our enemies are hidden behind crowns, walking in the shadows of kings and queens. Who are the ones that walk in the shadows for the people? We are. Something has come of all of this, and it starts right now. We must continue the fight and defend the free will of the people. And no matter how small, our brotherhood is the only hope, and our kingdom needs no crowns. What we believe in, our values, our creed, will unify us. And I promise that for all the songs of Egypt, I will be the father I was not that day in Siwa. To the Brotherhood! The Brotherhood! You were right. I trusted the wrong goddess. There's a question that yet lingers. Septimius. He took Alexander's staff. Why? Indeed. He and Flavius had too much interest in Alexander's tomb. We start there. Stop your flailing. You will live, fool. Flavius was behind the door. Uh, I'm sorry. Flavius killed your son. They were here. They took the orb from me. They've gone to Siwa. Siwa? Bayek, Aya. Your people are in danger. God, now! Fare thee well, Apollodorus. To the house of Hades. Who created this? The gods themselves? Here's the story of mankind. Bayek! Bayek! <gasps> it is Hepsifa. My Sammy! Your life is done here in the desert dust. It 
took my closest friend. We must rush to stop Flavius. No! We cannot leave him here! He deserves a proper farewell. Entered the temple vault. Septimius and Flavius. The objects they carried opened it as if by a god's hand. And so they tried to stop them. But they rendered it helpless. They entered the vault. A blue fire seemed to emerge. I fled to no avail. The entire village lost its reason and fell to the ground like dogs. They have destroyed Siwa! They must die! You must put an end to this! Bayek! Aya! You have the prayers of the entire village to support you! Let us bring Hepzibah to his rest. Then, we will seek justice! Sorry, it is just he was such a gentle soul. Once had me treat a wounded dog he had caught in a snare. Why would he do this? I have seen this before in Siwa. I'm looking for the soul leader responsible, Flavius. The proconsul? That sack of rancid god shit murdered my son, raised my village, and now marches through your land with the light of Amunra. Come. Let us search the farm. Look for survivors. I am Bayakusiwa. Praxila, of this land gone mad. Nanette, are you all right? What happened here? Red cloaks and that milk soup with the lion's head. Took anyone who could work. Farmhands, my son Kade, everyone. Then. He came. Dark eyes hooded as a raven. I wanted to throw stones to shoo him off. Something golden, bright in his claws. Held it up, crowing as they fell before him. Some by their own hands, others by those dearest to them. Against nature, everyone crying, screaming, running, dying. How did you... No one sees Poon in it. An old woman's husk with clouded eyes. But I saw them, didn't cry out, bit my tongue till I choked on the blood. The men who did this, we will find them. Better hurry, girl. Raven flew north to the home of the Huntress, overheard Red Cloak squawking. Bring Kade back to me. I will try. Flavius also robbed me of my boy. Let us bring Nenet to my cart. When you arrive in Cyrene, look for my friend Diocles. I would trust him with my life and yours. As a magistrate, he hears petitioners in the Agora. Give him this. I hope this heals the madness in this land. I pray you get the justice you seek, Bayek. Came back from Balagre with a crook up his arse. Demanded my taxes for the year. They burned my farm when I refused. And you are sure it was Leander's men? My wife said no good would come of defying him. I hate it when she's right. Leander will pay. You have my word. Your word, Diocles? Will not sow my scorched fields? Bring my goats back to life? I am done with you. End this land. Your word. Pah. 
And how has our most venerated magistrate extorted you, Egyptian? Praxila said you could help me. I am Bayek. Is he all right? As well as anyone can be with Flavius desecrating your land. I followed that fucker's murderous trail all the way from Siwa. So the rumors? True. As are his preparations for war. One more oppressor. Egypt will never be stable again. Invasions upon invasions. Flavius will make of Egypt one giant tomb. He rules from the Acropolis, but is crawling with Romans. I pray the dice fall in your favor, Bayek. I must deal with his lapdog, the magistrate Leander. Seek me out again, if you would be a friend to Cyrene. Thank you. It's just order of ancient propaganda. Flavius has turned you into the enemies of free... Do you think I can't feel you skulking in the shadows, Bayek of Siwa? I have followed your path of murder and madness all the way from my homeland. And now, you will answer for my son's death, Roman! No, Egyptian. Now you will bow before your god! He was a child, Flavius. My child! Now that's the one thing I do not regret in my life. I will never give you peace! Your son's death made the order bow to me! Caesar, even. I had Rome! It gave me an empire of a thousand sons, each one greater than the last. Ah! Ah! Come on! Finish me! You coward! The waste of time! <laughs> I can't do it! I can't! I can't do it! It's alright, Papa. No. I will... I will lose you forever. Not forever. I will be waiting for you in the field of reeds. Been too long. Flavius is dead. I have gone through shit to get our son out of the Duat. Hemu is at peace. May he walk in the field of reeds. I head to Rome to Rome? You still entertain fully with these ambitions. I have made mistakes. You have made mistakes. Aya? You waste your energy. Ah, you are the famous Magi. Thanos never ceases to speak of your exploits. I have assembled a group. This is Brutus and Cassius, our Roman brothers. We're going to cut these bastards down from across the seas. Septimius and Caesar. The order is no longer an Egyptian problem only. Does Cleopatra still rule? There is no ruler in Egypt. Plunged into the will of various tyrants. Our queen has abandoned us for Rome. Nothing has changed here. Memphis is overrun by the Order. Aya, we need you. Our victories have multiplied. Our bond not so. We could never have been. Everything has told us our love is impossible. You are right. Something bigger has called us. But our love lives in the Duat. Only now we are letting go. Let the gods decide. The gods are dead.
must sacrifice our personal lives for the greater good. All this darkness was for a reason. I was wrong to be so reckless in public without killing. We must work in the shadows. Egypt has fallen. Greece also. And Rome will fall too. All will fall to the creed, yet no one will know. When we assassinate, we assassinate only those who deserve it. The few sick souls who try to control us. But they will never know who we are. Cold, calculated, poets of the kill. I am fine with this. I am not a father anymore. I am not a husband. I am not a Medjay. I am a hidden one. Yes. We are the hidden ones. We sharpen our blades and pull what hope is left from this foul earth. Good, Bayek of Siwa. What are you of now? A new creed. Ours is finished. Those don't need to be your last words. Who the fuck are you? Does the name William Miles ring a bell? The assassin? Then you know who I am. We, the assassins, have been watching you. It's unusual for an Abstergo employee to take an interest in a country's revolution. You're not wrong there. We know about your work with the Animus. Astounding what you and Deanna were up to. D. They played you, didn't they? Sophia Ricken made you so many promises. Enough! We're not talking about her. Sure. Plenty of other subjects to cover on our ride to Alexandria. Don't assume I'm going anywhere with you. Well, let's look at your options. You can come with me, or you can stay here and do the dance of death again and again until you make a mistake. They only need you to make one. There's no going back to your old life, Layla. I never planned to. But you'd finally be able to work on the Animus project. Our version of it. And with us, you'd always have the freedom to do things your way. Fine. Let's do this. That doesn't mean I'm on your side. Good enough. Let it rain! Down you demons into the sea! Hey, you slackers! Form up with the rest! Today, we sail together! What port are you taking us to? There is a town called Antium I'd like to try. Lots of merchants sail in and out of there. Should be safe for you. From there, it's a half day's ride to Rome. It is only a matter of days before Caesar will officially become a tyrant. There he is. The people love you, Caesar. You're a god. The Senate will not bow so easily. That parliament of clucking heads. Let me be your wolf. Go. Do nothing until I give this in.
Damn you, Lupa. My son's heart. For your life. Was revenge everything you hoped? You and the Medjai shall drench the sheets with your sweat tonight. <laughs> Stuff. With the Order, I served them and your beloved Egypt. And I'll be rewarded in the afterlife. An eternity of drinking and whoring with my brothers. The only thing that waits for you is oblivion. For your name, your Order, and the rotting corpses of your Gavignani. Up and devour your fetid heart. I know you. You who strikes from the shadows. The same fate will come to all despots. In the end, it is impossible not to become what others believe you are. And I was a god! There is a new creed now. Yeah! Rome is eternal! She will never fall to you or your kind. Freedom is not given, Caesar. It is taken. Requiescat in pace, Caesar. Do you know what you've done? Caesarian would have sat on the throne of Rome. Listen to the cries in the streets. They call you a dead tyrant's whore. I am still your queen. You are a queen of liars and snakes. I fought for you for five years. Our people worshipped you. Apollodorus died for you, for Egypt. For Egypt? I am Egypt! Then be the ruler our people deserve. Or nothing will save you from my blade across your throat. You are the last of the pharaohs. Bayek. Caesar has been assassinated. Septimius is also dead. I have founded a bureau in the middle of Rome. The immortal thing in the world. Free. 
I don't want to go home by myself. I'm scared. Should we take him to the bureau? No. I'll take you home. Let nothing grieve you beyond measure, for your life is short and time will claim its toll. But I am no longer who I was. I have renounced all love I once had. I have renounced Aya. I have killed Aya. I am now the Hidden One, known as Amunet. May your victories multiply.